The task force tips foamy ductor is very, very unique in so many ways. When we originally set out to design this, there were several key features that we looked at that we think will be benefits in the users operationally out in the field. The first thing we noted is most fire departments either have a reluctance or don't do well when they're trying to flush an eductor down after use. So the first thing we targeted is try to find a simple, easy way that the eductor can be back flushed and cleaned out very simply and very quickly on the fire ground. In this case, we have a red knob on top that you just hit with your hand during operations. And what it does, it presses the little diaphragm down inside and allows fresh water to backflow through the metering head and out the tube, basically cleaning the whole system out. 30 to 60 seconds of doing this, the adductor is clean and ready to use next time you have a fire. The other thing that we found was often storage. Okay, in this case, uh, with the hose, it can be a little unwieldy in a compartment and compartments are so tight anymore on the fire trucks, trying to find ways to mount these on the fire truck can be a bit of a challenge. So we make a very simple, quick disconnect. This allows the unit to be stored flat or it can be stored in any sort of configurations or holders or anything that might be in the truck. And again, it allows it to very quickly be reattached. In this case, an attachment or a detachment like this, this can still be in a charged hose line and it allows you to take the metering head off to clean it or to do something else and then it can be put back on with no leaking or anything coming out of the hose. Something else you'll notice if you've ever used a competitor's eductor in any way, shape, or form is the hose, the pickup tube is often very, very, quite a bit smaller. Um, here you'll see that this is probably 50% higher in size and inside diameter than we have on some of the other competitive models that are out there. Why did we do this? You know, in the old days, picking up class A foam and straight A triple F was fairly simple. It was fairly thin. It came right up through the tube. Today, with the new alcohol resistant concentrates, they're much, much thicker than they were many, many years ago. But we feel that the future today is alcohol resistant concentrates. 1% by three, three by three, these sort of foams. And to pick those up accurately and efficiently, we have to have a much bigger tube. The other thing that you'll notice if you look on the inlet, of um, our pickup tube, the stainless steel pickup tube on the end of it, you won't see a screen in there as you do in a lot of the competitors models. Well that screen also tends to restrict the pickup and flow of these alcohol resistant concentrates. So that's the reason that we use no screen. And finally, one of the other big benefits we found, um, actually it was a problem that we kind of changed over to a benefit was often using a competitive model you cannot tell the percentage setting. You can't see it especially in dim light or at night or during a fire ground operation. It's very hard so often there was a mismatch of what you're supposed to be using and what the percentage was actually set at at the adductor. So very very large numbers, very large letters, a big indicator. It gives you a very good positive detent feel no matter which percentage you've, you've picked, either a quarter or a half percent for our, a, uh, our Class A foams or one, three, or six percent for the AFFF and the alcohol resistant foams. Whatever it is, very easy to see, very easy to change, even under pressure, and very simple to use. So those are pretty much the main features and benefits we have of the TFT adductor. Now, from an operational standpoint, they operate very much like every other adductor in the marketplace does. So we'd like you for those parameters to take a look at our other videos that we have on TFT University or go ahead and reference the information in the manual that comes with the adductor, which gives you not only the operational characteristics, but some of the other things you have to know about hose lays, engine pressures, and things like that. Also, another great tool that we have if you're trying to do some planning for your foam operations, which will give you some idea of how much concentrate you should carry and application rates, is the TFT slide chart. The inside of that is all about foam applications. So let us know. We're happy to send these out to you. If you have any questions on our fully ductor series, either the two and a half or the inch and a half series in flows of 60, 95, or 125 gallons a minute, just let the customer service team know at 800-348-2686 or visit the TFT website at tft.com.